So we were having a little conversation on the crew the other day about wire sizes. And it made me think of something that I wasn't sure if everybody understood. Have you ever noticed on some wire, it says MCM and other times it says KCMIL. Do you know what the difference is? Nothing. It's two different ways of saying the same thing. So wire, the area of the conductor is measured in circular mils. KCMIL stands for K being thousand, C M I L circular mills. I have a piece of 397 right here. This is 397.5 chickadee ACSR. The conductor area in circular mills is 397,500 circular mills. Well, what is MCM? M is the Roman numeral for a thousand. CM is circular mills. 397.5 MCM. 397.5 KCMIL. So I've actually got two different 397s here. So a lot of you probably noticed on your reels, there's always a bird name for ACSR. ACSR is named after birds. So I have a piece of chickadee and a piece of ibis, two different birds. Chickadee is 18 to one and ibis is 26 to seven. So what that means is ACSR this aluminum conductor, steel reinforced wire. There's 18 strands of aluminum to one steel strand core. The steel strand being for strength. On the IBIS, there's 26 strands of aluminum conductor to seven strands of steel core. So obviously the IBIS is stronger. It's designed for longer spans. This is what we use on our sub transmission, our 69 kV lines. Whereas the chickadee is for the distribution, shorter spans. They both have the same number of circular mills. They both have very similar current carrying capacities, although there's some differences. And the IBIS is actually just a little bit bigger. I put a micrometer on it earlier and, and found that out. But like I said, it's a little trivial thing, but I didn't think everybody knew that. So I thought I'd pass it along. Knowledge is power.